thicken. So these are the XXL Sculpted Square. So they're not as long as a 5XL, of course, because these are XXL size. So they go in with the category of the XXL Sculpted Series. This is a zero, see? It's a, it's, she's a good length, I think. And she's got a really beautiful arch to her. And she's got a nice C curve. Look at that. She's got a 50% C curve. Super sexy, okay? Very, very straight sidewalls. No taper. To give you that boxy, Kardashian, Kylie Jenner look that the kids love nowadays. Or the 80s for some girls too. Look at that. So dope. And these are pre-etched already too. So you don't have to do anything out of the, um, out of the bag. So I'm going to show you guys really quickly, just give you a quick little tease, because you guys know how I am, of our water sticker, our water decal, the slider line, which are called Magic Nail Dress. And with that system, you're going to be using a, um, a stamper. And I'm going to give you guys just a quick little sneak peek of the stamper that we're going to be launching. So this is going to be our stamper. What's actually... It's um, ready to go, but we, I just had to just wait a little bit to launch it because I have so much new, uh, new stuff that we've launched already. But let me show you really quickly. So you're going to have to get the stamper and the sets of the water sliders separate, but I'm just going to show you guys really quickly one of the five sets of water sliders that we're launching, where they're called Magic Nail Dress. And this is the Bulgarian Rose one, so you get five different ones per set. Look at that, aren't they dope? And when we do do the big old launch of these, I'm going to show you guys in detail on the website how to um, use them for all the fantasy. So we have so many dope things here that I, like, I don't even know where to start for the fantasy. So should we do something like with gold? Should we do something iridescent? What should we do, you guys? Let me know in the comments below. Let me get my other phone so I can see the comments too. Should we do something with like maybe different shapes of glitter? Bonnie said, love it. I sent a message in your messenger. Please look, I actually don't reply to messages in my messenger. If you need to contact us, just um, feel free to email the website, my love. And the website is info at enogatour.com with any question you might have. I see iridescent. Iridescent once, iridescent twice. I see all purple, iridescent times three. Okay, so iridescent she is. So let's use, should we use tuxedo or should we use, I don't know what happened. Let's go in with, um, Peel off base coat. I'm just gonna do a nice little coat on my nail. Make sure you get that free edge right there. And I apologize, I don't know how long I was babbling by myself because I got a little message for the thunderstorm that's gonna happen. base coat. This is a secret on how I take my nails off every single day. I'm going to be careful with this pinky because I actually cut it cooking. That's why I don't cook. Because then I hurt myself. So let's pick out the glitters that we want. I think I feel like I'm missing some of those still. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is really pretty. I really like this blue. What do you guys think? Hello Max, hi! Are you guys loving the new glitters? 
if you guys have reached 100 views at the end of the video, we're going to do a giveaway. I'm going to give away a tube of pink DIY gel. This blue would be really pretty. With maybe the gold. The purple should maybe be purple? Or should I wait save that for my mom? This orange is really dope too. Look at this orange, you guys. And some with like the confetti <coughs> from the pink one dream. <coughs> Sorry. And that's the spicy lemonade. I put cayenne pepper in my lemonade because it helps burn fat. But I think I put a little bit too much. And I don't know which one to start with. There's so many. Oh my gosh. Why is my life so hard? Or should we do something with the cheesecake? There's so much stuff. Let's go in with this one first. This is Moon Girl. So let's put this one to run in two. This is cool. Maybe with some um, silver. Okay. This is from Pegasus. From Pegasus, let's go in with... Uh, which one should we use? This one? Like the rosy kind of one? It's pretty. So Pegasus is a metallic sequence, which is really dope. Maybe this is a silver one. One more. I know, this one. So this is Venus Star. And I'm gonna use the iridescent one from Venus Star. And that's it. Enough matching yeah. Measure the nails now, and these are the brand new XXL sculpted square. I actually do not know the meaning of the word enough. I try. Oh, Stephanie sent me 50 stars, thank you! Yay! I appreciate that, that's really sweet. So I'm gonna go for that really boxy look today. I feel like I haven't done that look in a while. Mary's joining us, hi Mary! And now let's measure the pinky. Come on, you guys, if we reach 100 views, we're gonna do a giveaway. I'm gonna take a little permanent marker. It is. I'm just gonna map out where I'm going to put the fantasy. It's the ring finger. This is the middle finger right there. And then to encapsulate everything, I'm going to use the press-on gel in clear. Let's get a little liner brush to Let's just say the magic liner. The OG. So this is from Moon Girl, this is purple. Iridescent Lake Fantasy. This is from 
Venus girl. And if the glitter is too big, you can always go in and just take your scissors and just give her a quick little trim. And this is from Arthemis. This is a silver. So we're going to take press on gel, apply it to the inside of the nail. Wherever the bigger glitters are going to be, we're going to add more, okay? So that we have enough to make sure that it is um, encapsulated properly. And press down firmly, and then we're going to take some of this for the dope purple fantasy. Some of the iridescent glitter. Silver from Artemis. Wow, look how dope that looks. Can you guys see? What do you guys think? Super magical, right? Are the comments working, you guys? Let me know. Somebody say something. Somebody give me the website so I can pin it. about encapsulating is you have so much control over where everything is placed. You can determine how much or how little you apply to the phalange. And then you can, it's working, okay great. You can take your flashy and just give her a quick little cure. the larger glitters are going to be you want to add more gel there because you want to make sure it's properly encapsulated all the way so that way it won't like move around or anything like that cool thing about working on the rubber mat is that you can place glitters on it and pick them up fairly easily actually. Because if it's rubber it will not stick. So that makes cleanup a breeze. Take some of the hologram iridescent glitter from being a star. Put it around. And then some of the silver from 
Artemis. Can the camera pick it up well, you guys? Let me know. Let's freeze it for a few seconds. Let's do the middle finger now. One of the many, many uses of press on gel, like legit. That's why she's a bottom chick, because what can't she do? better. So let's go in with the Artemis and some silver metallic. Have you guys seen the new Space Jam movie? I guess they were saying it was one of the worst movies of the year. It was that bad and I was like, geez, really? I haven't seen it.
Artemis. And the brush we're using is the Sailor Magic Liner Brush. So dope. Looks like ice. Focus camera. Here we go. So let's freeze it for a few seconds. Let's put this stuff away because I don't want to spill any. Make a big old mess because you guys know I'm the hugest klutz in the world. If you guys are not busy, you can start making the little uh, nail dress sets. Yes, there's lots of little baggies. I have the one separated up here if you want to start making them. So I'm going to bake these for just about 30 seconds because I'm going to layer another layer of clear press-on gel on top so that way any of the pink um, DIY gel doesn't leak into the glitters, the little spaces in between. And the little... Um, what are they called? We have a whole bunch of those little uh, styrofoam bags, the little ones with the bubbles on them that have the seal on them already. Yeah, there's. Oh, that should one should go with the Nikita set. Mm -hmm. Rooftop garden, and then Bulgarian rose and Gen Z. Oh, I heard. We're looking for tape. If you guys know where they sell cheap tape, a lot of it, let us know in the comments below. Because tape is expensive now. It went up like 10 bucks. So a little thin layer of clear press on gel to seal in the glitters so that way they do not go anywhere. We don't have any bubbles in them. that for just 10 seconds so should we do the base of the nail in clear or should we do it in pink what do you guys think let me know in the comments below the little ones that we got yesterday that have a uh, bubble on them they should be up in the front there's a few boxes of them Hi, Jamie. They don't. It went up $10 on Amazon. The packing tape is ridiculously expensive now on Amazon. I was like, what? Really? We used to get 36 rolls for like under 40 bucks. Now it's like 50 some dollars a roll of, pack of a package. And if you order more, they charge you shipping, so it's not free anymore. So let's go in with some pink DIY gel. Use the 
nozzle to move it around. Rock it on into place. for a little bit. So dope. I'm just gonna follow the cuticle area just a little bit so it fits my finger a little bit better. This is a 150. I heard it like my phone was like frozen for like five minutes and I was just like rambling on and the whole thing was like there's a severe thunderstorm warning yes and it froze my live stream so remember they have a higher apex so if your nail is a little bit on the flatter side you do want to use a little bit more of the pink DIY gel Yeah, because they're pretty small.
dope. Last but not least is the pinky. Love the pink DIY. Isn't the color so dope? It's really flattering on every skin tone too. That's what I love about it too. It's such a universal shade. seconds because I'm going to do a little layer of shiny on the inside. on the inside. You can do shiny gel or wonder. It's up to you. And this is just going to seal everything. So I'm going to bake it for one minute and set the dancing darling lamp. shape. Just a little blending here and there, a little tailoring of the nail. and tailor her a little bit. Give her a 
really nice square finish. Look at that. Look at that secret you guys. Wow, stunning. Doesn't that look like a full set of like encapsulated acrylic or encapsulated hard gels? So let's go in with... Carrot bits of blend in the cuticle. Mixer bit. At about 15,000 RPM just to go in and really get that HD finish around the critical.
Okay. And then let's go in with the buffer and just buff the whole top of the surface. I love this card, it's strong. Huh. When people ask how strong is that peel off base coat, she's pretty strong. She comes off very, very easily. Ever troublesome pinky, she is pressed all the time. Let us go in with Wonder Gel. She's here somewhere. Where did she go? Where did you go, Wonder Gel? You can smell her. I found the older bottle, this will do. And so let's coat the entire fantasy in one nice coat of Wonder Doll to bring you that diamond like shine.
before we cure, we're going to turn the hand upside down to let the gel self-level out. I don't know why no comments are coming out. That's really weird. So let's go ahead and bake this for one minute inside the dazzling darling lamp. Have you gotten a chance to order some of the new glitters, you guys? Let me know which one's your favorite set. There's Artemis, there's Pegasus, there's Tuxedo, there's Moon Girl, there's Luna. That shine. Remember, after the hand comes out of the lamp, we're gonna wait 10 seconds before we apply cotton candy cuticle oil, okay? Oh, there's that pinky again. She is trouble. There we have it, my loves. The encapsulated icebreaker fantasy. What do you guys think of the new extreme XXL sculpted square? Do you love that C curve and the super straight sides? And the color of the pink person goes so magical. Giving me the stained glass fantasy. Well my love, that's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget to check out the brand new XXL Sculpted Square and all the new girls that we dropped. I love you guys so, so much. Stay safe, stay out of trouble. And I will see you guys in the next live video. Look at that for the pose. The pink is the background. Yes. It's so hard to uh, photograph clear nails because we need something to really contrast it. Beautiful. Well, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye, everybody.